that body count. <laughs> Have y'all ever done it in public? Done what? Boy, somebody said for Seb, how big is it? <laughs> Who said I love you first? Yeah. What the fuck is up, guys? Sandy here, back with another banger episode. Today we have two very special guests. We have. Sebi Sibs and Fernanda, other known as Ferruco. We call her Ferruco in this household. And we also have Kev behind the scenes. Come say hi, Kev. Kev, Kev, Kev. What's up, fat dicks? Hey, flip it so we can see where we're in frame. Oh, yeah, facts. So we can make sure Kev can get his lick in. Kev's stuff will be down in the description. No, we have. Oh, yeah, that looks live. Come see. Come see. Today is a very special day because this is the very first couple that I've had on my channel. Because I've had Jake and Valentina in the videos, but I haven't like featured them. Huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, Jake and Valentina, if you want to do this next, how about you let me borrow Jacob for a little bit, Val? Mm -hmm. Get out. Come on, bro. Nah, but yeah, we love them. We'll have them soon. But today, Boiling Crab has been nice enough, nice enough to give us crab, fucking lobster. You want anything, Kev? Did you? Nah, I'm good. I got hell. You wanna come say hi, Jose? Come say hi, come say hi. He's for my chair. Huh? He's looking for my chair. Oh, I'm using it. Clap it up for Jose. Clap it up for Jose! He's letting us borrow his chair so we can prop the camera up for this mukbang. But uh, yeah, Kev is gonna be asking us questions as we devour. You want some crab though? You want some crab? Yeah. Yeah, go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Nah, I'll wait, I'll wait. Alright, bet. We're gonna start with the lobster. Y'all wanna start with the lobster? I mean, yeah. shit, it's already in front of us. Fernanda here likes to watch a lot of mukbangs, so she should be very experienced. I don't know, I don't know. I personally have never sat down and watched a full mukbang. I know that's like a lot of what I do, but god damn. Like for me, when I watch YouTube, I don't really watch mukbangs, but shit. I like making mukbangs. Yeah. I like eating food, so. So we you out. out then? We out. Oh my god, bro. I always forget how the lobster is. Go oh, ahead, thank you to Boiling Crab, because I didn't pay for this food. They were like, look, Sandy, you saw your mug bangs? Ah, shit. And we want to like, offer you, you know, a comp meal. I'm like, shit, how much can I order? And we were like, as much as you want. Just let us know when and where, and we'll get it for you. Then you got all this for free? For free, bro. You know what? Free. God damn, Look at bro. that, we got King Crab. You know what the total was? Like, if you were to buy, if you were to mm -hmm. buy it, probably yeah. like 130. Nah, you way off, my boy. Way off. Shit, that's more? Way off. Look behind you. All right, oh, yeah. I forgot to mention. We have three lobsters, two pounds of King Crab, four pounds of shrimp. Oh, damn, All this bullshit, and it's like two, three more bags still. So, what you think the price is, kid? Man, I think, alright, 250. Still off. More. More? Yeah. What the fuck? This is wild. Damn, this the bullshit. Crab looking fire. Hey, you could do that, so I'll get a nice little trip. Is it medium? No, what kind of spice is that bad boy? I don't know, I just feel like anything. That bitch is spicy. Mm -hmm. She feels like water or what? Yeah. You've had crab before, right, Kev? You remember when yeah. we were in San Antonio and you tried crab for the first time? Yes. But it's just that, it's too much work. You see all that bullshit here? Yeah. All that nonsense? Look at it. It's, I mean, yeah, it's good, but fuck all that. All right, now get into the questions. A lot of people, I feel like you guys have made a couple of YouTube videos, right? Yeah, we made like two or three. Have y'all made like Q&As and shit? Or like I getting to know y'all? You doing one? But like more about like relationships. Mm, so it's the first relationship exclusive. Ooh, mm -hmm. exclusive. All right, but let's get to the questions next. A lot of people want to know y'all personally, you feel me? All right, good. first question, start off basic, simple. How did all of y'all meet? Okay, let's do this. Let's do how y'all met, and okay, then we'll do how me and Seb met. Okay. You can, you can tell. I'll tell the story. So, yeah. basically, I was scrolling on TikTok, right? Oh, I know how, I know how. You know, I was just I was just looking for some potential suitors. <laughs> <laughs> no, you. Some potential uh, baby carriers, huh? Yeah, and uh, I, seen this, I seen this one shorty. She was moving her hips in a particular direction. Word, word. And I was like, damn, she can move her hips. She move my hips. And then you DM her and she declined you, so you DM her after. That's not how I went down. Oh, no, no, no. Okay, okay. Why are you eating my phone? I'll open it for you, bro. Oh, damn. Yeah. Uh, he did. Why don't we invite couples on the channel? Because I feel like he's going to fight. He's going to fight, are you? I'm grateful as motherfucker, huh? Nah, but she, she, was being, she was being nice and she was opening the cloud for him. And he was like, Yo, why you taking my cloud for real? She be, she be like that. She be, she be like that. Damn! She be this is why me and Kev single for real, huh, Kev? It's not, be single, right? Here, Kev, let me open this crab for you. Dip it in hell. Yeah, low key, I'm good, bro. Yeah, so good. <laughs> <laughs> I was opening it for this bitch. Yo, low key, I'm good. Alright, uh huh, go ahead, proceed. So then, uh, she had followed me. She was like a little fan. Wait, yeah. she had already followed you, right? Yeah, she had already followed me. Oh, so it said follow. Back. Uh -huh. It said follow back. Why did you follow him? Me? Because I'm saying. Oh, I saw his fan post. And I was like, oh, he a white boy. Oh, he get a cute. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he a white boy. What's that cute? And I followed him. And then 
and I felt he was like, With what intentions? Oh, just like, at that time I didn't know. Like, I ever thought like, oh, I'm on a date. Mm, you never thought I was going to date. Like, follow, like, you follow, like, I feel like you just follow people you think yeah, are cute. Yeah, like that, yeah. You know, that's what I was doing at the time. Okay. Oh, shit. And then, Yo, same though, so at what? the time. Same. At the times. We were in though, weren't we? Yeah, we were in We was living together. Huh? It was me and the boys. And then, you know, I just hit in the DM with a little Novia. You just said Novia? I just said Novia. Smooth, what? smooth. And, uh, Not too crazy, straight to the point. I was... I was Wait, would you, you DM there like Novia? I just, said, I just said no, no, I just said, Novia. Just Novia. I don't that ask works? No, I don't ask no questions, Kev. You said that works? Yo, I'm not trying that then. Yeah, write that down, Kev. Write that down, write that down. Kev, write it down. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I got it. That's because it's like simple, you feel me? It's like, yeah. you get the point, like, yo. Oh, yeah, it's simple for Seb, because he has a flat dick. And, and I mean, him. it is Seb, though, and he's a white boy, but yeah. he's cute, though. Wow. Cool. And then she said, no, yo. Uh -huh. And I was like, wow, well, I'm fucking with your energy, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. You match my energy, we just went from there. So I just started texting? Yeah, we started texting, and she was like, I was like, where are you from? She was like, Uda White. Damn. And I was like, shit. Yeah, the thing about that is I remember vividly Seb showing me his phone, and showed me her saying, look, bro, this is my wife. I remember it vividly. And I was like, oh, where's your staff? He was like, oh, who do I? I'm like, boy, what you gonna do with somebody from who I? I doubted him. And now here we are, sitting next to his girlfriend, and Sebi said, the man himself. I'm sorry I doubted you, bro. You gotta trust the process. But like, he just knew, you feel me? He was like, this is my wife, bro. Yeah. I'll look at him. Next question or something? No, 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 me and you, bro. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, bro. Like, expedite the process, you feel me? How did me and Sammy meet? Yeah. Um, I was in LA. I think it was my first time in LA, right? Yeah. And I was on my flight back home. Like, I was like waiting for my. It was like, your last day in LA. Yeah. And then my boy was Harry Jazzy. Mm hmm. Harry Jazzy was like, oh, y'all can come over. Um, Santi's here too. Like, he has his bag with him too. Like, y'all can just come over and wait. And I was like, I never met this man before, but. Yeah. So basically, he was waiting to go to the airport, and I, it was my last day in LA too. And we had a mutual friend, and he told me, he, I, "Well, actually, I surprised Harry Johnson. That was the day I met him." Oh shit! And then you were just vibing there already, right? And he pulled up. I'm I think he pulled up. Shit, I don't know. We just met through a mutual friend, and then we went to the airport together, and then we we vibed for like a couple hours, and we became friends in those couple hours. You know. The next time I was in LA, we actually hung out, and it was vibes from there. But yeah, basically. They met, he DM'd her Novia. Damn, wait, wait, going back to that, you came all the way from Uruguay. I did. Just to meet him. How did that go down? Damn, Sebi said that like that? Sebi said that like that, for real. Oh, shit. It's a Seb effect. Sheesh. Well, how did that go down? Uh, we were talking from um, FaceTime for like, well, like, almost three months. Yeah. Three what? months? Wait, so were you that type to like, oh, were y'all that type like, to like, fall asleep? Like, with each other on FaceTime? Yeah. 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 Mm. Sheesh. So it was getting down, down there. Then, do you be doing that too, right, Kev? No, I don't. Oh, okay. <laughs> Moving on. And then I don't know how, but I convinced my parents to let me. Really? Yeah. I have no idea how good. Like, did you tell your parents about him? Yeah. All right, what they think? Um, My mom wanted to come with me to meet him, so she came with me. Okay. Because, like, you know that you're yeah, your you're girl. Fine. Facts. Um, Everybody wanted a chance to see Sebi Sebi. Even mama wanted a slice of shit. Everybody wanted a little slice. Okay, okay. And then y'all met here with mama? Yeah. Uh, I mean, I met him first, but yeah. And she liked him? Yeah, she did. Damn. I don't know, you know. Man's got a girl to fly out. Now look. He did a bit more flight. Oh. <laughs> 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 yeah, I want to be the dude. Y'all do what you want to watch. It's like the hit, you know, right? Yeah, <laughs> Them flights be adding up for real. Yo, facts though. Shit, how much was that plane ticket though? Yeah, how much like was it? Oh, you out with that one? I was telling her, I was telling her I'll pay for your flight. I know. But like, I hadn't looked at the flight prices yet. Oh, I searched up. Right? I seen like 800. Oh, yeah, you were like, like <laughs> nah, you got that. Yeah, that's how you do it, my boy. She got that for real. You got that for no real. Cap. Hey, bro. I just finished that. That lobster? Yeah. Boy, what are you looking for in there? There's no meat in there. Motherfucker has been. No, there's only meat in the tail. Well, that's Motherfucker crab meat. has been breaking the crab this whole time. The crab meat is fire. I just finished the lobster. That holds fire. I'm on to this next crab. Unless Sebi want it. You want this one? Is that the only crab you have? No, we have another bag. Oh, you got it. Right. But yeah, anyways, enough of flying women out. Let's move on to the next question. All right, so next question is, do you guys think it is wrong to still be mad at someone, even if that long ass question, dude. Come on, bro. You my fuck fault, me my up, fault. Man. I fucked up the flow. My fault. Go ahead. I have to read this shit again, man. <laughs> Look, this is a good one. Do you guys think 
it is wrong to still be mad at someone even if they apologize and mean it. Like they did something wrong, like, like you, but like if they apologize. It depends how wrong it was. Yeah, it depends on like what what it was. You feel me? Because if it's like cheating or some shit, you feel me? Like yeah. you could feel sorry, but you still get it. Yeah, I don't really understand the question, but yeah, it, no kidding ass question, but no kidding ass question, my fault. Go ahead and move on to something else. Look for a good one. Editing be everything though, buddy. So it's gonna look like we just keep talking and talking. Yeah, fuck it. Basic ass question, man. Fuck it. All right, we gonna go ahead and add the shrimp onto the menu. Where are the paper towels? There's also paper towels behind you if you wanna yeah. get some of those. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Wait, have y'all's parents met each other? Oh, have, no, 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 they talk a lot. Yeah. Y'all parents haven't met? No. no, my mom and his mom like talk a lot. Your mom talks to his mom or? Yeah, on WhatsApp, yeah. On WhatsApp? Yeah. What they be talking about? Life. Uh, yeah, life. Because like, they most have um, French, so they just... What? The f they're studying French? No, they, no, they talk they French. 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 Yeah, they both speak French. Why did your mom speak French, Seb? Just because? It's her first language. She's Haitian. Right? Oh, shit. <laughs> I didn't know they spoke French in Haiti. No, me neither. They speak French and Haitian Creole. Haitian All that too. If y'all didn't know that, what are your nationalities? I mean, she's from Uruguay. Uh, I'm from Miami, but my mom is Haitian. My dad is Chileno. God damn. I'm a fucking foreign for real. What about you, Federico? I'm from Uruguay. Straight, 100%. Uh huh. I mean, I'm, I'm from Spain, though, but like, yeah. Jeez. What languages do you know? Just English and Spanish? Yeah. You? Uh, English, some Spanish, some French. They so, speak, some, speak some French. Go. Say that sentence. Yeah, I can't talk to you with that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sweaty as fuck, bro. Yeah. And one thing about me when I do these mukbangs, I be sweating, boy. Yeah, you do. Alright, okay, this question. Next question, Gav. How did y'all's first date go? Ooh, that's a good question, Gav. Now you, bro, go ahead. Spill the beans. First date? Mm-hmm. Um, it was my first day here. Don't be lying. Don't be lying, huh? Don't be lying, huh? It was my first day in um, Miami. Okay. And he beat me up from my hotel. Gee, straight to the point, don't it? Uh -huh. And he told me to watch a movie. Oh, he was uh, talking uh, straight into it, huh? Well, this you? stupid guy booked a movie for the other day, so there was no movie. <laughs> <laughs> hey, to Taco Bell. That's what she thinks. Yeah. Oh, not for up. Bro, he, he took me to a Taco Bell. <laughs> Disappointed as fuck, bro. You took me to a Taco Bell, bro. Yo, yeah, what's wrong with Taco Bell? No, but on the first day, bro. Oh, that is, I mean, leave it down below in the comments how you would feel if your man, you flew hours. How many hours? Like, like twelve. You fly twelve hours to see a beautiful man like this. He picks you up in the hotel in his little boat, swaggy. You feel me? It's vibes. Y'all chilling, and he takes you to Taco Bell. I'm not saying there's nothing wrong with it, but I want to see what the people think. See, let me let me give you some some context though. Go ahead, go ahead and give me some context clues, cause Kev needs some. Yeah, See, I need some. In Uruguay, they don't got Taco Bell. Oh. So to her, I'll take a little more me. Oh, so you were thinking ahead. You were thinking, oh, she think this some five star shit. <laughs> nah, it's like she had like a list of all the all the places she wanted to try. All the places she wanted to try in America. And Taco Bell was on that list. So I was like, so really, what you were doing is being a gentleman. I was making her dreams come true for really. <laughs> <laughs> Hey. You know, I, did you enjoy yourself? It was horrible, but yeah. Oh, shit. Yeah, it was trash. I hate Taco Bell. Okay. Yeah. But you had a good time, right? It was good. Like, hey, was he being, you know, a good guy, gentleman, and whatnot? I mean, shit, y'all dating, so you must have yeah. done something right. I did. What'd you do right? Um. I was done. <laughs> <laughs> we gonna go ahead and move on from that question. Go ahead, Kev, okay, next yeah. question. Next question is. What are y'all's pet peeves about each other? Ooh. Yeah. That was good one, I don't. Yeah. Oh, he's he's sold out all the time. Mm. Oh, and yeah. I be talking and he's like, oh, I didn't hear you. Cause she be talking. <laughs> yeah, she be talking, bro. She's a human being. <laughs> she be yeah, talking. bro, cause she just be talking and shit. So. Bro, cause sometimes she be talking. <laughs> too, too much. Yeah. Bro, you're a dog. And, you do um, be talking, huh, do federal pool? Like yeah, sometimes she gets like really excited to talk and she'll like just talk about like just random stuff So I just zone out mm -hmm. and then when she's done, I'll be like I've seen it for a half. You do do that a little bit You too though, you do get really excited when you're talking about something I do Like yesterday at the sushi break, you were like So basically like I was saying like I don't know how to And then you just kept talking and then at the end I was like yeah, 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 facts I think it's in English. Sometimes you're like, I, think I so. know something in English. But that's good because you want to learn. Uh -huh. It's like you want to talk. Yeah. That's really good. You're going to learn, like, you're going to have perfect English in like no time. 
already I hope. That was already good as fuck, but it's gonna be like fluent, yeah. fluent. Alright, we're gonna add shrimp to the menu, but yeah, that's one pet peeve of her. What's pet peeves? Damn. You must have that's Don't be lying now. We be talking. Um, is her talking a pet peeve to you? Nah, not really. Like, I don't mind it because I'm a quiet person, so. That's cat. That is cat. What do you mean? You be talking this. You're I'm not shy, bitch. Not shy. Yes. You're not shy at all. Not from what I've seen. What's up, Manny? No. Nothing, chillin'. You good? Yeah, these yeah. shit's smashing. You're not gonna dog your lobster? I am. The whole cold as shit already? It's saving it. It's spicy. I'm gonna skip them out. Yeah, yeah. Shit, if you're not gonna dog it, me and Seb, I'll do it. Yeah, it'll be honest. Um. We got some hot milk. We got it. You don't want it? $40? Shit, just about. Pet peeve. I don't know. She be... Not perfect. It's hard for me. Oh. It's hard to... <laughs> I'm just trying to think of one that's not too harsh. Damn! Damn. Oh. Say it. So you trying to be nice, huh? Yeah. Dang, I really thought, boy, I'm about to eat two lobsters in one day. I'm never eating that much lobster. You want half of it, Sebi Yeah. We out. Come on, Sebi. You can say whatever you want to be. Um, she be like... <laughs> <laughs> I'm feeding it here. This, look, 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 this. She said she don't care, but she like. He can tell now. Damn. It's cause the camera on and shit, huh? Uh, yeah. I have to add like. Damn. Damn. You swear. You, you swear. You swear. You're black and shit. Don't fucking sound scared as shit. Um, Come on, Seth. Think of something. I don't know. Sometimes you be a little dirty. Damn. She like quits her job. She's lost it. My what? What do you mean by that? What? Like. I don't know. Like, you should be like throwing your clothes around. Uh, but I'm living in his room. I have no closet. You do? I gave her half of my closet. Okay, how about your closet, which is like nothing? It's well, like really, really <laughs> tiny. I'm using half and you're using half. And so y'all live together? Yeah, but it's hard to like leave uh, when you're in your, you know, your house and like have your stuff in like a luggage. It's that hard. is true. And like, I don't know. It's just hard. I'll get it better though. Like, this time is better than the last time. Well, so bad for you that she leaves clothes on the floor. Yeah, because I don't know, I don't have to have a dirty room. So. Mm -hmm, okay. And your pet peeve with him is he dissolves out. Mm -hmm. Those aren't too big. Those are like fixable problems. Yeah. I mean, that's good. Shit. Sure. That's the ones I can tell you come out with. Damn. Damn. So there's some behind the scenes pet yeah. peeves. Kev, okay, you got any pet peeves of me, Kev? On the top of my head? Yes, yeah, bitch. This motherfucker put the words in my mouth. Like I say something, this motherfucker repeats another like whole different sentence that I didn't even say. Why you do that, bruh? Like she what? She's annoying as shit. Like I say something. Do, do an example. For, I don't know. Like I'll just say something and then he just like says like a, a whole different I sentence. Think I think it's just because I have really bad hearing. That might be it. And not even me. He does it to like other motherfuckers too. Jake or everybody. I do do that. I feel like it's just for my own entertainment. Yeah, I be, I be making up stories sometimes too. Yeah, like I just be doing it for funsies. My bad, Kev. You chillin'? I'll try to do it less. Bro. Now, Ayrton, what are you doing? Come say what's up, man. Say what's up, Ayrton and Lingui. Yo, I just have oh, shit boom. on myself. <laughs> <laughs> he drank a big ass fucking coffee and he's been having a shit the whole day. Hey, you, you, you popping your head in the camera? How many, how many views is that? I mean, each second is another million. <laughs> Thank you for popping in, Ayrton. I Crazy, appreciate it. Bro. Damn, yeah, you think y'all gonna eat all of that food? Yeah, we're gonna find out. Oh, let's let's peep the crab. I got more crab. Yeah. Yeah. Damn, Do you like it? Hell yeah. Furuku? Do you like it? <laughs> yeah. no, what is it? Furuku? <laughs> Arrington loves to call Fernanda Furuku, and it's been catching on. Mm -hmm. yeah. Go ahead and ask the next question, Arrington Lingui. Choose a juicy Ooh. one. Somebody said for Seb, how big is it? <laughs> <laughs> how big is it, Seb? Or oh! she. Seb, you're gonna have to prove it wrong, Seb. <laughs> what are we talking? We talking three, we talking two, we talking five. This depends on the weather. <laughs> valid, valid. Um <laughs> there's something good going on here. What's your favorite memory together? Ooh. Ooh. It's a good one. <laughs> <laughs> now, what is he, now what are you saying? <laughs> what is he saying? Is it in bed or is it like, like a date? You're crying. We trying to see what the sex is like. <laughs> you asking what the people want to know, you feel me? Yeah. Yeah. It's not his question, it's the people. So now I remember one time I took her out to this, like, what do we do? <laughs> 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 
Boy. Damn, my camera. I don't have a good memory, bro. So I just be forgetting. Uh, maybe like um, last time um, I came, we went to Orlando. Y'all went to Orlando? Yeah. 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 He paid for it. Oh. Damn. Oh. Oh. Why are you good on that side? Damn, oh, you guys landed a brand dealer, son, huh? Because usually said be cheap, my boy. I remember when we was in Bacoma, he didn't want to pay for shit. Yeah. Oh, no, he took me to a cheap ass hotel. Bro, oh. <laughs> bro, it was a good hotel, though. What? It was the best cheap hotel you could have found. Yeah, yeah. Hey, you out with that one, Seb. I would have done the same shit. Yeah. I bet mean, me and Seb be on the same wavelength like, when it comes to money. Yeah. You don't really like to spend money like that, but. Shit, we all know. Next yeah. question, Eric Dini Linguini. Let me suck on that fat dick weenie. Do you prefer LA or Miami? Oh. Oh, definitely Miami. Damn. It's like that? It's like that. Fuck You got a cab out here, though. Yeah. Oh, if it comes to the boys, like, yeah, yeah. I fuck with LA. That's the only reason I come out here, really. Mm -hmm. For sure, for sure. But Miami's just home. We need to go to Miami, huh? We out to Miami. Jeez, okay, last question. Well, for, for me, actually. Last question from Argentina before he goes shitting. Les gusto Herrera Puerto Rico. <laughs> <laughs> now, boy, what is they saying? <laughs> now, what is they saying? <laughs> no, but I don't know what they say. What does that mean? Read it. Oh, les gusta oler perico? Wait, I sounded like that. You what did, Loki, eat up. Yeah, yeah. That's what? I think that's like, that's like drugs. Yeah, coke. Perico, like coke. Boy, next now, what is they saying? <laughs> ah, it's a good one. Who said I love you first? Damn. Ooh. Not a good one. Oh, wait, wait. Who is that? Hey. Like, technical question. Because mm -hmm. so we was on FaceTime once. Oh, you was going to say this. This is like the first. She looked mad already, bro. Look, look, look. The first like two or three months we was on FaceTime, like we had never met. We were just talking on FaceTime every day. And um, one night he just slipped out a little, I love you. Whoa. Whoa. Yeah, it was like, it was like, it was I like, didn't mean it. Like, you know when you say like I love you, just like to say it. Wait, so you didn't mean it? Oh, yeah. that's like no. Yeah. We were talking for like a month. So it like slipped like, out. Yeah, it was like, yeah. I love you. Oh, se te salió. Mm -hmm. Cause I love you. Oh. Yeah. Was it awkward? No. no. Yeah, you made it a lot, bro. What'd you say? I was like, uh, run it back. What you mean, run it back? I said it again. Oh, he was like, what do you but mean by that? But that was like the first time. Yeah, but then like, in person, I think I said it like the first night we met. Damn! <laughs> and I was like, I, I was like. She didn't say it back. <laughs> oh, what? Like, is it coming out of guard? Like, we just met. I was like, I was like, just me. I love you. No, he, he was like, he was <laughs> You're not gonna say that? <laughs> Boy, how would you feel, Argentina, if somebody did that to you? <laughs> Shit, they putting it down. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck does that even mean? <laughs> what does that mean, man? <laughs> <laughs> no, what is it? Manny, how would you feel if you told someone I love you? And they didn't say it back? They just stared at you. That's why I'm for the streets, babe. That's why I'm for the streets, babe. Street, babe. <laughs> how did you feel, Sabi Sabi, in that moment? Huh? He looked at me, he was. Uh, <laughs> oh, no, but like. Oh. Oh. No, but it was like the first night that like, we It was met. the first night. It was like weird. So he said too soon, and then what did you say? No, it wasn't because I didn't. Like, love, it was just like, I was, like, I was just like, trying to figure it out. Yeah, your emotions. It was like the first thing like we made in prison, so it was hard like to say that. I love you just like Yeah, no, I'm not blaming you for not saying it, because you got to feel it, you feel me, to uh -huh. say that. Yeah. And he felt it sooner than you, so I mean, it's, it's no I think I think I was saying it just to see if like, it felt good saying oh. it to him. Mm. Oh, we used to say te quiero a lot. Yeah. Like, that's how, like, you know, te quiero. Te quiero. Te amo, es así. Te quiero. 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 That's one thing I do notice about them. They're very cool with each other. Like they're friends. Like I'm, I hung out with a bunch of couples. And they always like all lovey dovey, or, like facing each other, or, like throwing shots. Oh baby. I'm yeah. not throwing shots at nobody because that's not how Jacob and Val are. I'm just saying couples in general. Jacob and Val are cool as fuck together too. Yeah. Because Val's kind of like a dude too, so she's be like chilling. What you mean a dude too? She, she acts like a dude. Like she's be like, no, yo, bro, ask me that. And, like you like, know what I mean? Just freaking the crap. But like they're like. I don't know, like friends, and then like yeah. obviously they're a couple, but they're like friends first, you know. And I like, I don't know, I just like the way y'all handle yourselves, you know. The dynamic. The dynamic, yeah, exactly. You have a very good dynamic. Yeah, like we're, we're like copyright. Boy, if you don't get that copyright, I'm gonna try some. Anyway, like I was saying, yeah, your dynamic is very good. Um, yo, yeah. okay, I'll try some. Bada bing, bada boom. Whoa, where were we? She said I love you. He didn't say it back. I when did you say? Oh, you said I love you. Yeah. She didn't say it back. When did you say it back? Probably the next day. 
Really? So no. you had like one night to think about it and shit? Yeah. And you're like, maybe I do look. I didn't say it back. It was not because I didn't have to. Uh, it, was it was just, just like, caught you off guard. Yeah, I just didn't feel like it's like. What you mean by that? Damn, you holding that fucking crab like a Glock. <laughs> look, so like a fucking yeah, gun. Man, this shit is good as fuck. Yeah. It's like you're just eating and it's just I like, thought it was gonna make me full, but like I just got like a black hole in my stomach. Yo, this shit just hit him. Where the crab at? Alright, bet. Right, next question. Who's the smartest out of the relationship? Ooh, that's a very good question. He's gonna say it. It's obviously me. Why do you why do you think so? Bro, because there's a saying that goes around the house. Around the house? Your Se household? Sebi says it's never wrong. Okay. <laughs> Sebi says is very smart though. I'll give you that much. He is smart. So he's smarter than you? There's so, so many stuff, times. Yeah. There's so many times I've told you like not to do something or to do something, and you and you don't listen. I'm very impulsive. And he's not. Very what? Impulsive. No, I'm very like logical, and like there's so many times where I tell her how things are gonna pan out, she doesn't listen, and then it ends up happening exactly the way I say it. So you're a fucking genius. A fucking mastermind. I feel like that's very true. Sebas has given me a lot of advice before, and it always ends up happening that way. I remember I was like worried about some TikTok shit that was happening at the time when we were friends, like at Pekin Koima. He like gave me advice and I took it and it worked out for me. So yeah. I've never doubted Sebi Sebs ever again. He is good with advice. He is very good. Very smart person too. All right, next question, Kev. This is a question for Sandy. Question for Sandy. Ooh. Seeing all these couples, does it make you want to get a girl? Or does it make you feel lonely? Mm. You know what I mean? You got them, you got Jayco, Val. Does it make you, you, got you want to get a girl? At times I do look at a couple and I'm like, no, I wish I had a girl to like, you know, be there for me like 24-7. Yeah. Because sometimes you just miss that little like warmth, you know? I mean like we thinking like, damn, like you could always count on your girl, you know? But I mean then there, there's like times where I think about like all the stress about having to worry about a whole other human being 24-7. It's like you have to worry about him all day every day. Yeah. She has and he has to worry about you all day every day. He doesn't want to worry about me. <laughs> <laughs> you <love him. laughs> But yeah, you get what I mean. Like you have to care for another person. Yeah. And it's just like too much work for me right now. Like right now, I'm like really focused on this YouTube thing that I'm doing, you feel me? Making sure I can put out videos. And if I have a girlfriend, she's gonna wanna go on dates. Or like I'm gonna wanna take her on dates. You know, I'm gonna feel bad if I don't take her nowhere and shit like it that. Time. It does take time. So I feel like as soon as I'm ready, I'll let y'all know. I feel like I feel like you just gotta find someone that's in the same level of motivation that you're at right now. That too, yeah. Like someone to push me. Yeah. Instead of holding me back, because there's a lot of relationships out there where like the guy will hold the girl back or the girl will hold the guy back from like becoming great or doing something. But like I feel like they push each other because like, I mean they're both content creators, which is very good. But they also like push each other personally, like in their own personal lives. I'll be seeing it when we're like eating and shit. You feel like you would have to date another content creator? Another question. I personally don't think I have to. I just have to get someone that would want to see me succeed in like content creation. You feel me? Cause if they don't want me to make content, like I love making content. It doesn't have to be a content creator. They just want to have to like push me. That's it. But yeah, I mean, if it's the right one, it's the right one. But so far, no cigar. Thank you for the question, Kev. For sure, man. Next question. <laughs> Who's the man in the relationship? Oh my God. She said that. She said that a couple days ago. She was like, I'm the man in the relationship. Then yeah, so who wears the pants in the relationship? It's always a me. See, so didn't I see or what? Hmm? Like, who we dogging though? <laughs> 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 you out there? <clears throat> not for real. Who got the pants? For real? No, Jokes aside. Is it really her? Uh, on reality, like, I feel like we both keep each other uh -huh. in check. In check? Yeah. Y'all be spanking each other? I think they both have the pants. Mmm. Ooh. This is a two pant pant relationship? Yeah. Yeah. We both got one leg in, in, the, in, the, in the driver's seat, however you say that shit. What the fuck is What are you saying? <laughs> Boy, you just saying fucking words. Damn, bro, this is my second bag of shrimp. But actually, I have them. Like, mm -hmm. legitimately, you got the pants for real? Yeah. I Why see. do you say that? Like, Damn. Damn. Just like that, sir? Lo mandas, lo mandas, lo mandas. Damn. I just stay quiet. Well, Dale, that fucking answers the question. I just stay quiet. Exactly. It's like you know who the leader is. I'm gonna say nothing. Damn. Damn. Let me know in the comments down below who you think got the goddamn pants in their relationship. Team Sebi Sebs or Team Perruco? Right, Ferruco? Motherfuckers can't even spell Ferruco. I can spell Ferruco right now. F E R U K O O. Ferruco. It's double R. Alright, we on to the next question, girl. <laughs> <laughs> 
Yeah, this shit is like not getting full. Like I'm I know. Just I think it's a seafood thing. And it just keeps like tasting good. I heard seafood makes you horny as fuck. Okay, boy. <laughs> <laughs> okay, boy. Let's yeah. shut up. <laughs> Yeah, she looked to be checking you. Bro, bro. that ass, so she's, she's doing with the pants, huh? She just came in the conversation and said, okay, boy. Mm. Yeah, you shut the hell up she's real good. Now, nah, Ferruco, chill, though. I feel like Ferruco, like another dude, too. Like the homie. Uh -huh. Like a dude. And Seb, like a girl. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Sometimes I forget he's a dude, yeah. Oh, my God. Mm. Can't cut that out of the video. <laughs> <laughs> Tell him what you told me earlier. Me? Yeah, about when you be kissing him. Yes, yeah, sometimes I be kissing him and I forget. I You're feel like, like he's a woman. You be like kissing him and in your head he's a woman? No, I just open my eyes and I see like his eyes and his hair and I'm like... Oh, it's a man. He's a, he's a, like a woman? I feel like that's a good thing though. So when you're kissing him, you feel the touch of a woman? Yeah. I feel like that's a good thing though. Sometimes. Cause what it's like... What things are good thing? Cause it's like, I feel like, it's like saying I got like woman lips or something. <laughs> Cause you know how men be having like... I feel like I'm just delicate. Mm -hmm. I agree. Your body's like soft and like your lips are. Flat. What the fuck are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we do a whole crowd of work. All right, next question. Appreciate you, Kev. This question, Savvy says. Savvy says, you listening? Kev, how many kids do you want? Damn, I'm thinking like two or three. So you know what I'm saying? If money's good, by the time I'm at that age. Uh, At what age do you think shit, like shit money good right now? Money good, but like <laughs> oh no, no, I can't have a kid. He said, "Oh no, money not good right now." It's kid money good. It's not kid money good. Yeah, crazy, right, done. Um, but yeah, um, maybe like two or three. Two or three kids, because I feel like I don't know. I don't want to like go through that whole process of like. What process? Like waking up at 3 a.m. every night. You don't have to take, take care of a crime. <laughs> she be on your ass, bitch. <laughs> she be on that ass. Oh, damn. Like, you don't get to say that. <laughs> Jose yeah. just back there laughing his ass off. <laughs> now why is he smiling back there, Jose? You want a shirt? Yeah, them boots had a squinch. <laughs> so how many kids, Seth? Three kids? You want lemon on it? Here we go. Lady. One boy, one girl? With that. What about you, Two. I can go through two pregnancies. That's it. You don't know until you try it. Bro, because pregnancy is like fucking. What did you do when you pregnant, bro? Pregnancy is what? They like work. Boy, they be fucking. Bro, they be cutting their like stomachs open to take the baby out, bro. Oh, Sometimes. What? Yeah, I know, but like, imagine having like, oh yeah, I can't do this, cut my stomach open. Is that how you were born? Mm, I don't know. I don't think so. No, my mom doesn't. But you're like nine start. months with like a baby and a baby. But you get to like create life. To lucky her, huh? Yeah. I'll give that to anyone. I don't want to create life. Imagine if dudes could give birth. That would only be vibes because we would like make it a competition and shit about who could give birth fastest and shit. Yeah. I feel like dudes are very competitive. But yeah, y'all got like I'm around the same mindset with kids, then. Yeah. Like at what age though do you plan on? Like, Very good question, host Kev. Very good question. Twenty-seven and up. Twenty-seven and up. Depends where life takes it to take me. To be honest, uh, I used to be like twenty-five, but like that's too young, huh? I feel like at twenty-five, I'm still gonna be on my grind. Yeah. I see that. I don't want to have like, cause I feel like kids can stop like everything for a few years. Bro, kids put everything on hold for like at least like seven or eight. So I want to like, I don't know, I want to keep crying until like, I feel like I can stop having kids. I like that mindset a lot. Yeah. Same mindset I have. All right, Kev, next question. Next question. Who is the most clingiest? Yeah, who's clingiest? Clingy? Yeah, clingy. Oh, I told, I told her what clingy means a few days ago. She didn't know what it meant. Oh, what's clingy? How do you, how do you say clingy in Spanish? Oh, Let her answer since she know what clingy is now. Uh, like, like, like all the time at the top of someone, is that? Yeah. Yeah, basically. Okay. Who's more like that? You. Yeah. He needs more He's affection. more like touch, touchy, and I'm more like yeah. rewards. I'm very, like, my love rewards. Rewards? Like, words. Like, I like, like, saying stuff. Oh, verbal, like words. Yeah, words. Okay. Yeah. And he's more like touchy. Mm -hmm. I see that. Sevs do like to touch people. He used to hug me all the time and touch me. He don't touch me. <laughs> <laughs> no, what is you? Hey, how's your shit? I didn't go yet. I'm trying to let it brew up a little. I'm telling you, <laughs> eat a little bit of shrimp. It's gonna get you yeah, right in the stomach. I'll kill it one for you. You want one? Ask question, man. Okay. Um. 
All right, we we got Arrington back in the cut. He gonna ask a couple questions. What what is y'all's zodiac sign? Mm. I'm a Cancer. I'm a Scorpio. I'm a Scorpio. Next question, Kev Peace. Kev Peace. No, Kev Peace is in the building mm -hmm. now. No. You ask it. Would they have a threesome with you? Now what is he saying? No. Now what is he saying? I'm trying to get to the question. <laughs> <laughs> who gets jealous the most? Or have a good one. Like who is the most jealous? Who's the most jealous? We don't really get jealous. Oh yeah, we don't. I've noticed that about them too. She'd be talking about girls and guys in front of him, and he'd be talking about girls in front of her. Like as a joke, obviously, but they just be laughing about it. It's not a joke. No, it's not. Oh, it's not a joke. No. He he do be like that. That's fat. She be like, yeah, it is. <laughs> it is. Shit. They're not lying, cause yesterday me and Sam were looking at some shorties. We were looking at some baddies for real. On the top. Who? Now, boy, y'all was looking at me. <laughs> <laughs> like I said, some baddies for real. Exactly, some baddies for the BBC. Now, nah, yeah, we were hanging out and we were just like, and she was talking to you said somebody was fine. Oh, yeah. And I hit him there. And then she, he said someone was fine. Like, shit, she is, to be honest. I'd fuck her. It was on vibes. No, I mean, jealousy isn't really a thing, I guess, in their relationship. Um, I mean, like, we get together all the time, so like, what would we get jealous about? That is true. We live together. That's the thing. That's what I would want. Like, if you out there and you want me, feel me, you can get jealous, because there's a lot of shorties in this world. You feel me? There's a lot of shiny pieces out there. There's a lot of shiny pieces out there. But if you the shiny piece, you have nothing to worry about, you feel me? You just have to be able to trust me. Now, what the fuck is y'all switching? Oh, no, 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 yeah. No, he do not sound Spanish. If I was a sauce, I would be some sperm. <laughs> I would be. Man, what kind of fucking question is that? <laughs> yeah, I was Next question. That. Have y'all ever done it in public? <laughs> done what? Boy, not what I do. <laughs> well, you know what I'm saying. The sex. Have we, have we done it in public? Nah, I mean. <laughs> <laughs> Man, these motherfuckers lying, I think, but the car? The car, probably. Who? Okay, next question. They did it in the car. Next question. Who is Seba's favorite guy with you? That's a very, very, very hard question. Damn. I met Santi first, but when we was in Pacorma, I was sleeping with Jose. Hmm? Hey, yo. Hey, yo. Hey, I didn't mean it like that. I didn't mean it like that. We just didn't have enough beds, so they just crashed together. Um, I don't know. I like all of them. You like all of us equally? Yeah. Who's your favorite one, though? I say one, though. You know what I'm saying? your favorite one. You know Sandy's my favorite, man. Yeah. Thank you, buddy. Nah, it's just I think it's because we hang out most. Yeah. Like, if you hung out with Jose, obviously Jose would be his favorite. If you hung out with Jay. But me and Sam hang out the most. Word on the street, right, 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 is that Peruco over there is bisexual. Is this true? Yes, I am. So you're bisexual, like guys and girls. Uh -huh. So you be thinking he's a girl sometimes. So that got me thinking. You feel me? Would you rather be with a girl or a guy? Nah, if anything, that's good. That's an advantage, my boy. Said he said shit. My boy up. <laughs> he's not gonna dab you up right now, bro. But like I said, would you rather be with a girl? Um, or a guy? I always say this is my last guy. He's your last guy? Yeah, I'm totally lesbian. So if he don't work out, you 100% lesbian. Ladies, you heard it here first. If this don't work out, go ahead and DM for Ruko. She gonna be on the market, so don't fuck up, Sebi Sebs. You know what I'm going to after her. Where are you going to? <laughs> <laughs> you heard that, Kev? Shit, he going out of Kev. He going out of Kev. Next question for all, all three of y'all. Okay. What's y'all's favorite position? Favorite sex position? Boy, why is y'all <laughs> taking selfies? <laughs> oh yeah, you got posting that. They're fucking taking selfies. <laughs> um, favorite position? <laughs> You can hear Kev, shut the fuck up! They're over there talking about fucking tag me, tag me. Go. Favorite sex position. Go, Sammy. Favorite sex position for me. I like I like missionary. <laughs> what am I? Now what, what is missionary? <laughs> missionary is when she's on her back and y'all are facing each other. Well, I thought you were talking about church. We're not talking about church right now. <laughs> My favorite position. Missionary. Yeah, missionary. Cause like when I be doing back shots, like Loki, I be making bus. Now why is y'all whispering? Man, speak up, bruh! 
Look, my favorite position. Why you want to know so bad? <laughs> For the people, man. <laughs> <laughs> the best people. Oh. Hey, they ain't even asked that question. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they did. They did. No, no, they I should have went off. No, I see. I see Kev. I see Kev. He was like this. He was like, yeah. I was just talking. I bet. This about to be juicy. Now, what's your favorite position? My favorite position. Um, I do like missionary, but I also like um, I like back shots. I like. Oh, well, I'm gone. <laughs> <laughs> Where you going, Arantina? <laughs> well, Should we do a question for them? Should we do this I mean, one thing? Oh, what is it called, though? You don't have to do it for here. Nah, I don't even. What's, what's your favorite? I like me on top. But on top, on top or like the sitting down. The sitting down thing. The sitting down thing? What is the sitting down thing? Like, like you're sitting down. Let's say, let's say I'm like this, right? I'm sitting down like this. Let's say I'm sitting down like this, mm -hmm. and then she'll like sit down like this. And my back is here. Very intense. Have you ever tried that? If anyone right. of you wants to do the sitting down thing, go ahead and hit my DMs. Go ahead and hit Kev's DMs. Go ahead and hit Maddie's DMs. Because we want to see what the sitting down thing is all about. Sitting down? Oh, I know. I just need to refresh in my memory. I just oh, you've been there, done that? Been there, done that. Oh, shit. Not me. Shit. I'm out, though. Yo. Next question, Kevy Kev's. Wait, so what is that position even called, man? Isn't it called that? writing? Like when you're just writing? It's just uh, like a yeah, writing. Isn't it writing? Isn't it Nah. No, no, no. It's just it's like, not that? Just, uh, he just like, it's just like a form of writing. Sitting You're just down, writing while like, sitting down. Like that, and I'm like... And she's sitting, sitting down, down here. here. Like my legs are here. And y'all just moving like the motion of the ocean. Like we're both like like comfortable. We both can move. Y'all going to do that in these questions? You guys... Yeah. Yeah, we finished everything. Damn, I'm about to grab after this. I guess. So there's some, there's some, there's some shrimp. There's shrimp in there. Yeah, you got dog in this. It's like two or three. Yeah, like I'm not full, but it's like they hit the spot. Damn, look at that water bottle that hole ran through. You guys want more water bottle? Nah, I'm chilling. I'm chilling. Right there. I'm chilling. Water? Thank you. All right, we're gonna do like two more questions. Go ahead, man. You chilling? Gonna we're one. gonna do like two more questions. <laughs> and then we out sucking dick. <laughs> Go ahead, Kev. Okay, two more questions. We haven't talked about y'all's TikTok at all. You feel me? Y'all are very popular on the app TikTok. If y'all haven't yet, make sure y'all go check them out. Um, Seba, how many followers do you have? Like six point one, six point two million. Six point two million. Ferruco, how many you got? One point six million. So basically, the people want to know when it comes to TikTok. Obviously, your content is different from hers. She's more of like a dancer, uh -huh. mm -hmm. and you're more of like what? Well, how would you describe your content? Just vibes. Like funny humor, like right? Vibes. Huh? Okay, look, y'all have a lot of like toxical videos and like fucking yeah. videos where you're like messing with her and shit. Uh -huh. Are those videos real or are they like scripted or what's the vibes on those? What it's do like, the boy, did you just it. suck on the water? <laughs> <Girl. Do that. laughs> I had a little bit of the juice left on the ass. Dog that. Go ahead, Sammy Sam, talk to the people. Uh, it's like both, because um, I'll come over with like, with the night. Oh, okay. <laughs> K-Vibes. Oh, God damn, that's K-Vibes right now. Don't look at that. Don't look at that. Don't look at that. Switch in, switch in. I'll come up with an idea for a video. Like, I had a video where like I was making fun of her on her period. Mm -hmm. And like, but she'll actually be on her period when I make the video. Uh -huh. And I'll actually make her mad to make the video. Better. So, oh. so like, it's real, but like, I don't know, like. Obviously, you're recording it, you might need more than one take. Yeah. But it's like, you're actually making her mad. And he yeah. makes me so fucking mad. Like, like I wanna get out of the car and like, just, like don't do the fucking video. Yeah. Really? Man, so you're like a genius for real. Yeah, like, I'll be like. Damn. I like mess up on purpose so she gets mad so I have to give her the take. Damn. You heard it here first. That's why this motherfucker gets billions and quadrillions of views. Because he fucking incorporates real life with skits. Damn, I respect that. So what about you? How you come up with your video ideas? You just be peeping audios and bro I love it. <laughs> <laughs> um yeah. You'd be helpful someone. Yeah, I'll, t I'll tell you some dances to do. Yeah, because he he used to be a dancer too. He used to Boy, did you used to see his videos? No. If you used to be on TikTok like in 2019, don't, right? Don't look at them. If you used to be on TikTok in 2019, this motherfucker was running that shit. Jeez. He was. You remember this? That's me. <laughs> he started that shit. My, my respect to him. I used to watch a couple of his videos when I was in high school. I did. That's cringy as fuck. Shit, it was cringy, but I thought you was the shit. Jeez. How many followers did he have by the time when you were looking at him and shit? Did he have like a head? I had like one minute to the Okay, million. I remember. Your dreams, kids. Crazy as fuck. This is my idol. I want her to be this. Uh, now me and Kev do it for fun too. All right, but next question and last question of the day. Yeah, man, the last question of the day is, what is you guys' body count? 
Shanti! What's your body count, my boy? The question we've all been waiting for. <laughs> what is Sandy's body count? Man? No, 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 not that. What is Kev's body count? The question we've all been waiting for, what is our body count? Alright, Kev, you can go first since you've been excluded. I'm gonna say the truth, a lie, or what? Well, you. I'm gonna keep it a buck. Since we're the hosts, we get to lie. We get but to lie. But since they're the guests, they don't get to lie. My body count is zero. My body count is zero. We out. Sammy says. I just want to lie, Kev. Alright. <laughs> 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 hey, come on, come on, come on. Sammy says, what is that body count? I have no shame. I'm a very honest person. Uh, I've only, uh, it's only one. One? Oh, look, right here. What the hell are you saying? What the hell are you saying? What's the body count? Uh, it's ten. Just see if you like to know. It's ten. It's ten. Ten? It's ten. I'm not gonna lie. Ten? Is this still recording? Yeah. Because <laughs> if you think about it, ten, that's like once a year. Yeah. I'm 20, so that's like. So you said so you were fucking ten? when you were 10, you God, fucking bitch. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> if your math is correct, you've been fucking yeah. since you were 10. It ain't even that bad. 365 days. Cozy, why is you laughing over there? <laughs> <laughs> you a dog for real. So 10? I mean, 10 is not bad. I feel like it's reasonable for my age. Reasonable. Um, two. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, my boy. Let me. You gotta go ahead and get up. Yeah. <laughs> All right. That's gonna be the mug bag. I hope you guys enjoyed having Sammy Sims. And Ms. Ferruca, I wanna say thank you for coming and being on the Sandy Mug Band. I wanna say thank you to Kev, as always, for being here with me. Um, if you guys want more couples on the channel, let me know. We might have to get Jay in here, huh? We haven't had Jay in here. Jay and Valentina might be the next couple, but I wanna say thank you to y'all. Go ahead and check them out. I uh, hope you. Damn, I'm about to throw up all this fucking seafood. <laughs> we ate so much fucking seafood. This is the most I've ever eaten in the mukbang. Thank you for. Oh shit. Damn. Yeah. <laughs> I'm trying to show the fucking plate. Look. Bro, grab the camera with. Damn. Cause, bro, look at all this. Yeah, yeah. Food, show him. Show him. Show him. Look at all the shrimp I ate. But like I said, I want to say thank you to Mr. Sebi Sebs and Ms. Faruko. Go check them out down below. They do TikTok and YouTube as well. Thank you, and we'll catch you guys next week. Mwah.